So I intend to start this vlog exactly how it ends and that is on a big armchair. Now, before I send you guys hurtling on the road of Universal Studios, I just wanna say I uploaded the first travel vlog yesterday and you guys have blown it up and I cannot thank you enough for that. I'm so, so glad you guys are getting use out of it as well as hopefully enjoying it at the same time because it just makes it more enjoyable for me to do. Just a quick disclaimer before starting this video, it's been so hard to film at Universal due to the restrictions that they've put in place, such as no filming on rides, metal detectors, etc. So please bear with it. It does get so much more interesting and first person based as I move on to Disney. Anyway, as I was saying guys, please stick with the series. I think you're gonna love it. Let's get straight into this vlog of Universal Studios on our second day. Let's go. Welcome to the first day out. We've just arrived at Universal Studios. Haven't really recorded the wake up and stuff because it was a bit chaotic this morning sorting out all the cases and everything. But we'll be on to the first day. We're now heading. What park we're in? What one's this at Universal? Studios. We're in Hollywood Studios. Um, the Scooby Doo fans out. You can see it. I was also going to be recording on the GoPro, but I decided that it's going to be better off recording on my phone as you can't take your GoPro on any rides in Universal so bear that in mind if you are thinking of coming here and recording the rides you're actually not allowed to so I won't be able to show you the rides today however I'll show you as much around as I can so let's get to it top tips for you guys uh, I'm going to try and do these daily if I find them but if you um, are looking to go back to your hotel room any of the four resorts here at Universal that's the Hard Rock the Royal Pacific and two others which I'm not sure the names of but if you are thinking of taking boat transport for that make sure you plan it around a possible thunderstorm in the afternoon because as many of you would know florida experiences a thunderstorm every single afternoon of an evening but problem with that is the boat trans the boat transport doesn't run if there's thunderstorms so if you've got kids or you're not particularly able to walk decent distances Make sure to be thinking whether you want to stay the whole afternoon until the transport runs again or maybe leave a little earlier and then come back a bit later on in the night. Just keep that in mind. About to look in the Derby Hat Shop. So the Derby Hat Shop is no longer open and they've changed it to the main Universal store instead. So the Derby Hat Shop isn't there, which is fine. We'll get a, we'll get a cowboy hat a bit later on. The famous stars. We're on, we're on Hollywood Studios. We're down here. This is bringing back some memories because, um, as you guys know, Hollywood Studios. What did it used to be called? No. We're back in front of the anchor. At, I don't know where we are, but photo is being taken. Well, so as it turns out, if you guys are staying at one of the Universal Resorts, you get early access and fast track, which means you can cut the queues. And in my opinion, so far, I know I can't really show around, but it seems very, very useful so far as uh, we've basically cut off 40 minutes of queuing. Uh, pretty much jumped straight on. So I'd say it's well worth it. You're okay. <laughs> so, come off the ET ride. I'd definitely recommend doing that. It's a classic, 30 years old now, that ride. I think it's the oldest ride in the park. Woo! It's weird today because it's not, it's not excruciatingly hot. It's just like, it's a nice heat. We are souvenir shopping. I like it. I don't know what comes. We've just completed the Simpsons ride, and uh, honest opinion, didn't like it too much. If you're travel sick in any way, or you get quite easily sick by motion, don't go on the Simpsons ride because it is very, very, very spinny visually sim stimulating type ride it's if you don't like spinny rides you don't like visual rides simulation do not go on it but um overall it weren't too bad made the family feel a little ill but except for that um we just about to head on men in black so top tip um if you want to know how it's about to truck it down at disney you look at the gift shops because they tend to be rammed when it's raining obviously everyone's getting out of the wet by a poncho so now we're jammed in the gift shop trying to get out for everyone who's been to florida and disney before knows that even though it's raining it's still boiling but it just makes the humidity go up just stupid man 
So now it's just mugger. But we shall command and prosper onwards. Also, sorry about these camera angles. I can't have to hold my phone down because if I hold it up, I end up smacking people. So sorry if you only see a lot of half my face most of the time. So, unlike us, try and have a plan for when it starts raining because at the moment we're strolling around. Obviously, when it starts raining, everyone has the same idea and goes straight into the the shops and restaurants and everything else. So now, we're a bit stuck. We're walking down the Beverly Hills Street at Universal Studios and we're looking for some food. Scuba Doo's over there. Having some photos. Um, we got these guys behind us. So if you're looking, if you're looking to come mid-afternoon, the only thing I'd, I'd warn you guys off is the weather, because as we found, it starts to get very uh, wet. Sadly, if you're here looking for us to do some food recommendations, we can recommend the hot dogs too, because that's about all we are getting this afternoon at Universal Studios. We are here for a week, so we'll be trying out some of the restaurants and stuff, but um, for today, hot dogs and chips it is, we think, and uh, we believe that's by the Krusty Krab meet and greet area. We're not doing too well, it's whole navigating Universal thing. We are UK nationals and not locals here, so bear with us. Look at this guy. This is why it's quite fun to go to Universal. What? Underling? Well, you have something on your mind. Don't have a photo card yet. Hi. Is it fear or courage that compels you? So when it comes to stage and stuff, I'm a bit of a geek. So seeing this is kind of mad. I mean, what a view. Wow. So we've just made the educated decision to go back to the hotel room as the storm doesn't seem to be passing. And we all are hungry. And all the restaurants here are rammed because it's raining. So we're heading back to the hotel restaurant. Uh, gonna get some lunch chill out for a little bit, maybe go in the pool, and then hopefully come back here tonight, depending on the weather. Because I just checked online, it's saying storms are due to continue till about 6 p.m., which isn't good, but we'll see. It's half past two. Well, oh, I can't, my watch is dead. It's 20 past two. Um, the weather's not looking too good, so we're debating whether to go to Volcano Bay and try our luck getting into laser rivers and stuff, see if they're back open after the storms, or, whether to just chill at the hotel for a little bit. We think we're gonna just try Volcano Bay, because why not? It's now seven o'clock at night. We got back from Universal through thunderstorms, so uh, everything was closed. And we've basically come out here for the past hour, just at the pool, um, not really doing much, just chilling. We're now about to order some food. Um, here's a good tip, uh, Uber Eats delivers to these hotels for 99 sent so nice and cheap delivery so if you actually are looking for any uh food and you're gonna pay for the hotel order from uber eats we're gonna kfc bargain bucket 11 quid about 11 dollars perfect i'm gonna take a seat in this big armchair to finish this vlog off so it's early on wednesday morning now um I'm, at, I'm one day behind on editing the vlogs, so when these come out, you're looking at previous day. But it's been amazing. I am sorry if the vlogs are a bit dodge at the moment. It's because I'm recording off my phone. I haven't got my camera gear set up. It's been the first couple of days, and I've got to admit, it's, a, it's, it's different when, you, when you're here somewhere with your family, when you're somewhere with your family in comparison to if you're just on your own, because you, you have to, you have to try and you know have enjoy yourself with them as well and at, at the end of the day that is the main reason we're here to enjoy the time as a family so bear with me on the camera work on the actual vlogs itself it will get better as we go into disney and later on into this week but for now it's half six in the morning here in america and today we're going to volcano bay so make sure to stay tuned for the next vlog where i'll be showing you about that